What's up guys, my name is Cole and welcome back to a brand new video, a brand new series, and all that kind of good shit. Um, so basically, if you guys haven't checked out my video earlier and you were not interested in this series, go and check it out. It's super funny. It's one of my regular edits uh, with all the memes and good stuff like that. So if you're not interested in this series, please go check that out. I posted it about a couple hours ago. So there you go. But anyways, let's get right into the brand new series. Uh, so I have been thinking of some new series ideas and I wanted to change up the pace a little bit. I'm not going to completely change my channel. This is a once a week thing. Uh, so I still will be posting the funny meme, Clash of Clans, comedy, stuff like that every day. Uh, but I just wanted to add a little bit change in the content for me and for you guys. Uh, because sometimes it does get hard to, you know, come up with ideas off the top of my head. And not saying I think really hard about it, I just kind of go into it. But, um, yeah, it gives me a day of the week where I can kind of recoup and just rely on one video that I'm always going to have. Uh, so what I would like to call this series is Topic Tuesday, and what Topic Tuesday is all about is where you guys, down in the comments, leave me a topic that you want me to talk about, whether it is Clash of Clans, whether it is Real World, uh, whatever it is, I will pick the top comments and the one that I find most interesting and go over it in a video every Tuesday. And yeah, so I hope you guys are ready for this, and let's get right into it. So today's topic is all about YouTube networks and what they are, uh, you know, stuff like that, what you, YouTube network I am signed to currently and all that kind of stuff. So if you are interested in doing YouTube, uh, you have a YouTube channel or you're looking for a new network or just interested about this in general, please stick around. Uh, so let's go ahead and start off with my YouTube network and my experience with networks and all this kind of stuff. Uh, so I have been on YouTube for a while now. Now this is not my first channel. Uh, hard to believe, but yeah, I mean, obviously I have a little bit of a clue what I'm doing. And so recently, I gained enough subscribers to join Curse Network, uh, which is actually Union for Gamers, and they are such an awesome YouTube network. So basically what networks are, are you have YouTube, and when you join YouTube, you have the standard AdSense program. Now that is what put ads on all your videos. This is directly through Google and is an awesome program for anyone beginning if they would just want a few like pocket change or whatever it is. Um, it's a great program, but you don't really have any support or backup in case anything goes wrong with your channel. Uh, so let's say someone accidentally flags you or does it on purpose uh, and you get uh, put at fault for that. You don't really have a way to you know fight that claim and possibly get your channel taken down. So uh, I have had to deal with that in the past and it really sucks. Uh, so I decided to go ahead and join this network. Now the reason I didn't choose like Machinima or TGN or Yaush or Fullscreen, you guys probably know those are really big uh, network names out there right now. And to be honest, they are great. I'm sure they're all good networks, but they're just not what I was looking for for a lot of reasons and I'm gonna go over those. So basically when you join uh, TGN or Machinima or people like that, you're usually going to get a revenue split. And this happens to all networks because obviously they need some benefit and you need some benefit and you're just there to help each other out and grow. Uh, but with Machinima and TGN and I think Yaush, it's a 60-40 split. So basically what that means is you get 60% of your ad revenue and they get 40 and that is actually a huge loss by you now keep in mind that each network uh, will have different availability to play ads like the one I'm on right now curse is awesome it is so badass they give me a super high CPM which is basically what you get paid for a thousand views um, there's no lock-in contract here but basically if you were on machinima or TGN they would take a shit ton of your money and they are just a really not that great of a network to work with uh, their contracts are terrible. They have lock-in contracts. So what a lock-in contract is, is three years or four years or something crazy like that where you have to stick with your channel. So if you guys know Godson, he did a video I think a week or so ago about him and Broadband TV and how he has been totally screwed out of his network. I mean, they have just been sucking money. Uh, they're definitely a 60-40 split. I looked into it actually and it's just a shitty situation. He is stuck there for about a year or so more and I really feel bad for the guy because obviously when he joined the network he probably was not that big and he wasn't making enough for an income to actually do this for a living and not saying this is all about the money it's just kind of nice to have a better network because why would you want to choose a shittier one uh, added on to that 
So he kind of got screwed out of that and I didn't want the same thing to happen to me and I don't want the same thing to happen to you guys. If you are a smaller channel, I highly recommend waiting until you can get to a better network like Curse. Don't just think, oh wow, I can get on Machinima, I can get on TGN, I can get on those guys because their minimum requirements are really low and they're low for a reason because they just want your money, they just want your time, they don't care about, you know, helping you. I mean, I'm sure they do a little bit, I'm not like trying to call them out, but... Uh, it's just not very beneficial to you to join them. So basically the requirements for Curse are you need at least 1,000 subscribers, 4,000 views in the last month or 8,000 views total and no subscribers or you know whatever subscribers you have below 1,000. And I went ahead and waited a while for that because I wanted to make sure this was the right network for me. So I went ahead and got accepted. Um, if you guys are interested in joining Curse, please use my link down below. Now this is not a promotional video at all. I'm not like, join Curse you guys or I'll fucking kill you. This is just me being a good guy and trying to steer you guys in the right direction so you guys don't end up in some of the fates like Godson and other YouTubers out there that have experiences. Uh, the great thing about the network, there's no lock-in, uh, so you, there is no contract. If I feel the need to leave, I can leave whenever I feel like it. I can leave right now, no questions asked, no contract signed. I could just leave right now and be totally okay with it. They wouldn't care, and that's awesome. Uh, they also do have a 90-10 split revenue, so that means I get 90% of my revenue. They get 10, which is so awesome, especially for the amount of CPM and great ad support that they have. Super cool, and I'm really happy with it so far, as well as their contract. Contracts are a big thing. Companies always try and fuck you over in contracts. You know, like those little fine print that you can't see, but they're definitely there. Now, those are in a lot of other companies. They don't want you reading your contracts, but the thing about Curse is their contract is open so I could literally post my, the contract up on the page right now and you guys could read all through it you can find it anywhere there's no loopholes they are just such a great company so if you guys are looking for a YouTube union or network to join highly recommend curse um, yeah I think that's just about it I don't really know I kinda went off on a ramble so if this is kinda like all over the place uh, I'm sorry about that, but hopefully you guys enjoyed a little change in video. Make sure you leave down in the comments my next topic to talk about. You know, it can be Clash of Clans, it can be World Issues, it can be I broke up with my girlfriend, what do I do, anything like that. Uh, you guys feel free to leave it down there and I will pick the top comments. So with that being said, you guys have a great day, and as always people, keep on clashing guys.